Greetings, South Carolina educator. My name is Rodney Evans, education associate here in the Office of Educator Effectiveness and Leadership Development. I will now overview for you day two morning independent work time from 9.30 a.m. until 11 o'clock a.m. for SCTS 4.0 Evaluator Training. The first activity that you will complete during your day two morning independent work time will be to observe and collect evidence. You will watch the grade seven science lesson and you will script what the teacher says and does along with what the students say and do. This document is available in the Google Classroom in your participant packet. You will use this information collected for the next activity. So make sure that you're scripting while watching the lesson. The next activity during this work time will be to categorize evidence. Here are your directions. You are assigned to indicators, standards and objectives, along with motivating students. You will need to use your script from the last activity to categorize your evidence for these assigned indicators on the document entitled Day 2 Afternoon Synchronous Session, Categorizing Evidence and Your Participant Packet in the Google Classroom. Be prepared to discuss this evidence with the group during the next synchronous session. This slide is a screenshot of the document that you will use to categorize your evidence. There are many opportunities for collecting evidence for the planning domain. During the analysis of the lesson plan, during the pre-conference, during the lesson observation, as well as during the analysis of student work. This slide highlights when you collect evidence prior to the lesson being observed during the pre-conference, while reviewing the lesson, as well as when you're generating questions from the lesson plan. Planning for the pre-conference is very important. You want to ensure that you review the lesson plan, review handouts and or assessments that will be used during the lesson, review unit plan or weekly lesson plans, Develop questions that lead the teacher to explain his or her planning decisions or clarify what will take place during the lesson. And also review previous evaluations for areas of reinforcement and refinement. Shortly, you will watch Mr. Bell's pre-conference. But before you watch the pre-conference, please take a moment to look over the lesson plan and develop questions aligned to the planning domain. You will use the document in your participant packet entitled Day 2 Morning Independent Work Time 3rd Grade Math Lesson Plan Questions for this activity. Please remember that you are not grading the lesson plan. Here are some questions to ask yourself. What evidence do you already have? And you still have to make sure it aligns with what you see in the lesson and mark those on the plan itself. And lastly, what questions does this lesson plan leave me with? Lastly, you will watch Mr. Bell's pre-conference third grade math lesson that's found in your Google Classroom and your participant packet. And we'll see you back in the main room at 12 noon.